Let's write a C program to find volume of a cylinder. You can see a diagram of cylinder on your computer screen right now. We ask the user to enter the values of radius of the cylinder as well as value for height of this cylinder. Using these two values, we calculate volume of the cylinder. Volume is equal to base area into height. Well, base is a circle, so area of a circle is pi r square. So let's replace this formula with base area. So volume is equal to pi r square into h. So using this formula, we calculate volume of the cylinder uh, in our C program. So let's get started. I'll declare a floating point constant variable pi and give it a value of 3.145. And I'll take a couple of more floating point variables that is r for radius, h for height and volume. I'll ask the user to enter the values for radius of the cylinder as well as height of the cylinder. So using these two values we calculate the volume of the cylinder using the formula pi r square into h. So let me store those values entered by the user inside the address of variables r and h. So the formula volume is equal to pi into r square that is r into r into h that's it so let's output this value onto the console window volume of cylinder is percentage f percentage f because it's floating point variable the result is present inside the variable volume so let me execute this and run the program so i'll give radius as 2 and height of the cylinder as 5. If radius is 2 meters and height is 5 meter, volume of the cell cylinder is 62.8 meter cube, cubic meter. Okay, so that's it. Follow the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code, notes, and discussion about this topic. Please stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog. Share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.